My name is Tiffany Larson and I am a co-founder of Unega Mountain Dog Rescue. About six years ago, we rescued our first female Akbash. She was left behind in a ditch and my son actually rescued her and brought her to us. We couldn't figure out how this dog got left. Was it just a surrender or someone dumped a dog? But in this valley, it doesn't usually happen that way. Come to find out, sheep had just moved through there. And if the dogs cannot keep up, they are left behind. And that's just the way it goes. After several months, we started educating ourselves on the plight of these dogs and their role in the ranchers' lives and moving flocks of sheep through the canyons here in Blaine County. And we come to find out that it is quite an issue, that there's lots of dogs left behind, there's lots of dogs being shot, litters of puppies being killed. Because if the dog can't work, then it's of no use to the rancher and it's a, a liability for them. So we have taken it upon ourselves to rescue as many LGDs, which is a livestock guard dog in this county, Akbash and Great Pyrenees, and try to educate people, um, not only that we rescue them and rehabilitate them and socialize them, but also teach the community that these dogs are under a livestock classification that they need to be removed from. And since the dogs have no rights and no voice themselves, we at Onega Mountain Dog Rescue are the dog's voice. And we have been pushing with the help of others to change the legislation and the listing of these dogs. When a rancher goes into a canyon here in Blaine County, they will have 100 to 200 heads of sheep in one canyon. They usually have anywhere from four to eight dogs working that flock of sheep and these are the Great Pyrenees and the Akbash. These are the guardian dogs, the muscle, the ones that are protecting the band of sheep. They work 24 seven, seven days a week, all summer long, in the heat, in the rain, very little food, no love, no protection, and they are the most loyal, hardworking dogs that you will ever come across. When we rescue dogs here, our first order is to socialize them and treat them well and feed them and get them vaccinated, teach them to be friendly. So that ultimately our goal is to get them adopted into a loving family. And a lot of people have the misconception that these dogs are, you're not able to control them. They're always aggressive. When in reality, the Great Pyrenees and the Akbash are one of the best family dogs you could ever have. They are loyal to your family, to your kids, to your house, to your property. The Great Pyrenees is one of the most sensitive breeds that you will ever come across. Onega Mountain Dog Rescue is a little bit different than maybe some other rescues. We are particular just to these two breeds uh, because they are so prevalent here in Blaine County. What makes us and sets us apart is the fact that we will drop everything and go rescue a dog. We will take that time and the effort to locate it, feed it, get it back to our sanctuary. Gary is an amazing man when it comes to his effort that he puts forth. The recent rescue of a dog off the Snake River is very lonely, very sad, and doesn't like to be alone. So Gary is actually sleeping in a sleeping bag next to him in the dirt to make sure he feels secure. And these are just some of the few things that we do that not too many rescues are gonna take the time to do. We are a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We usually only rescue anywhere between five and 10 dogs in a summertime. 
This last couple of months, we did a huge rescue of 41 dogs off a cruelty farm in Idaho. We were a little overwhelmed uh, with the magnitude of dogs and the expense that that entailed. Currently, we've done nine spay or neuters in the last two weeks at about $1,200 a piece. We are about $5,000 a month in dog food, not to mention dog beds, uh, medications, things like that. We at Inega are very grateful for the donations that we've received. We could not currently sustain our rescue without your generous contributions. I'm Tiffany with Unega Mountain Dog Rescue, and we will never turn a dog away.